some of your predictions for the future for space travel, space exploration? It's going to have a lot to do with, with our uh, approach to inspiring our kids. Mm -hmm. If we don't think it's important to inspire them on, on the ability for them to fly in space in their lifetime, if we don't uh, strongly believe that our nation is exceptional mm -hmm. and we want our kids to enjoy uh, the benefits and the thrill and the economic benefits also of being exceptional, we could go downhill, and I'm, I fear that we could go downhill very fast. Uh, however, uh, all it takes is an attitude turnaround, that, that it is important to inspire our kids. It is important to think about exploration and to think about being able to do something that, that our past generation was unable to do, and that is actually enjoy uh, the view and the weightless from orbit. Mm -hmm and enjoy a, a, a little uh, shore excursion by going around the moon mm -hmm. and looking at it very close. You know, it would be fun to, to do an, a, an elliptical pass around the moon because it has no atmosphere and you can go as low as you want. Right. Imagine going just a couple hundred feet above the highest mountains on the moon at 8,000 miles an hour. Uh, be pretty amazing. That would be life-changing, wouldn't it? Uh, the reason I mentioned that is something is possible to do.